Kinetics is a not-for-profit organization created by the auto insurance industry to help fight organized insurance crime. This video tells a story about how we do it. Meet Bob. Bob is the leader of an organized crime ring that makes money by defrauding insurance companies. They do this by staging collisions and collecting insurance benefits that they don't deserve. This is bad for everyone because staged collisions make roads less safe and lead to higher insurance premiums. Meet Maud. Maud is an innocent driver who, while driving to the store one day, became a victim of one of Bob's staged collisions. She had no idea that her accident was actually caused on purpose, and she had no idea that Bob and his three passengers were all in on the scam. Meet Kinetics. Kinetics helps insurers fight organized insurance crime. Kinetics uses a sophisticated data analytics tool to help insurers identify organized criminals like Bob and his friends and to protect people like Maud. To understand how Kinetics works, first we need to understand how Bob works. Bob and his friends have been defrauding insurers for years. They avoid getting caught by spreading their illegal activities around. They take out policies with one insurer, defraud that insurer, and then move on to another one, and another one, and so on. At each new insurer, the fraudsters change information about themselves so they won't be connected to previous activities. Over time, the result is a complex network of illegal activity. Unfortunately, each individual insurer can only see one small piece of the network. It's like looking through a keyhole. That's where Kinetics comes in. Kinetics does for insurers what they can't do on their own. See the whole picture. Here's how it works. Insurers send only carefully selected policy and claims data elements to Kinetics. The Kinetics tool is a sophisticated computer application that looks at the people, places, and things associated with claims. It makes connections and links that individual insurers can't see. It uses advanced analytics to identify unusual activity. In order to protect privacy, the data is pooled for analysis by the tool at Kinetics. It is not openly shared across insurers. Here's what the tool sees in the collision involving Maud and Bob and his friends. For Maud, the tool sees nothing unusual. Her claim is consistent with the severity of the damage and she's had little or no activity at other insurance companies. But the information about Bob and his friends tells a different story. The size of their claim for car damage and injury treatment is unusual for the severity of their accident. Also, Bob and some of his passengers look like they have been involved in some way in other accidents at other insurers. If the tool identifies a claim as potentially suspicious, it sends an alert to the affected insurer. This alert is not proof. It's up to the insurer to decide whether to look into it. The tool is very particular. It won't generate an alert unless there are multiple unusual indicators about the claim itself and multiple indicators that the claim is part of a bigger network. Only a very small percentage of claims the tool looks at result in an alert being generated. At this point, Kinetic's job is done. The next steps belong to the individual insurer involved. It is now up to investigators at the insurer to look at the alert and decide if they want to conduct their own internal investigation. It is only following an investigation that an insurer will make conclusions about a claim. In Bob's case, the insurer decides to investigate and the evidence collected during the investigation is enough to prove that the claim by Bob and his passengers is fraudulent. The insurer denies Bob's claim and notifies the police. The police investigate and eventually lay charges against Bob and his friends. Meanwhile, Maud's claims have been approved, her car has been fixed, and she's received treatment for her injuries. Maud gets what she needs. Bob gets what he deserves. For more information on Kinetic's commitment to privacy and security, watch our other videos or read our frequently asked questions.